Hello guys, welcome back. Today, I am here to explain you about Hercules and the three golden apples. And you might ask, who's Hercules? Hercules is a mythical legend who was born with three parents. It was a myth of Greece. So it might be real that there was really a man who was this strong as Hercules. So let's dive deep into the Hercules' myth. So let's see. First, how is Hercules so strong? So to answer that, we have a normal, uh, his uh, mother is very ordinary but she was a queen of Thebes and his father uh, was Zeus. You might ask, how was Zeus, the king of all, king, of all gods, was the son of Hercules? So, Zeus's plan was to make a very strong person who would one day rule the entire of Greece. But his plan was a failure because later on we'll explain about that. So, Hercules was born with three parents. His original dad was Ampeteron and he also had a twin brother named Iphiclus. So, the name of Hercules in the Roman mythology is Hercules. And in Greece, or Greek language, it says Heracles. So, today, he is known as Hercules, like the Roman mythology. So, what, what did uh, Hercules do that made him so uh, famous and stuff? Hercules was a brave young man who always defeated all evil who stand across his country. One time, he was sent into 12 different missions from the king of uh, Greece, what was we'll later talk about. So he was sent to 12 mission and today, because we can talk about all the missions in this video, so I will post all of the things in the description box. So, uh, in today's video, we will just explain about one of his missions, and that was to get three golden apples. It was sent by the king of Greece, and the king was jealous, and he, uh, some researchers estimate that he is quite old and quite jealous because Hercules was very strong and brave and he was very scared because he thought one day Hercules will become the king. So he had to make Hercules stay away from the country so it won't be po a possible threat for him. Uh, Hercules, w in the other hand, was brave. So, after all of the tasks, he did not care. He finished and completed all of his quests. One day, the king of uh, Greece, who was the name, was Eleusius. He thought of putting him in one dangerous mission to go to Hesperides and get three golden apples. They were said to be buried in the Hesperides. So, Hercules 
went to the quest in no time and then went there but he did not know the way so first when he was continuing his journey he met three maidens he asked them if they knew the way to hesperides they said the old man of the sea knows the way to hesperides so the hercu mighty hercules left to find the old man of the sea when he reached the shore he saw a old man sleeping he looked pretty strange and he had weird beard and other abnormal stuff a human can have like something like a fish or anything because he could uh, transform into anything he wants and he might escape so hercules decided to capture him and hold him tightly hercules was very careful he tiptoed his way across the sandy beach and gripped tightly to the old man the old man woke and then tried to free himself he also changed into a seabird a stag and many other things you can imagine of but hercules just got his grip tighter and tighter every animal he changed into so after a while the old man was exhausted so he asked finally who are you what do you want the hercules said i am hercules i want you to tell me and guide me where the where is hesperides the old man nodded and guided him to one of the giants he was sleeping also in the beach so hercules went there and woke up the giant the giant was furious and he stru- almost striked hercules with his giant humongous dangerous club but hercules dodged it and lifted the giant up and threw him away but the, when the giant came back he was 10 times stronger the the giant forced with great force and energy to hercules hercules did the same thing 10 times but he now knew that the giant was getting stronger and stronger the hercules knew that he needed to lift the giant up and not throw him to the ground so he lifted the giant up and then for a few minutes and then the giant lost all his strength and the giant said what do you want please put me down so hercules put him down and then said i want to know the place to hesperides so the giant uh, guided him to a titan called atlas so he went to atlas atlas was a titan who had a battle against zeus for their sins but still the titans failed and zeus put a uh atlas to hold the heavens so hercules asked atlas to get to ask to guide him to the way to hesperides but atlas said no one knows the way to hesperides except me so 
can you hold this guy so I can get the three apples for you? Uh, Hercules was very excited, so he took the sky from Atlas, and then Atlas took off to get the three golden apples. After a few time, the Titan Atlas came back with three golden apples. Hercules was pleased, and he asked Atlas to take the skies back. Atlas said, I won't take the skies back. I hold it for 1,000 years. Now you must hold it 1,000 years. I'll come back after it. Hercules was astonished. He could not wait because the king would not want him to come back. So... Hercules had a plan. He said to Atlas, Can you just w hold this for a minute? I'll just adjust the pads for my shoulder. So Atlas gradually took the skies back and Hercules took the three golden apples fast and then said goodbye to Atlas, who was astonished because he got tricked. After a few days of the long journey, Hercules returned back to Greece and gave the whole uh, golden apples to the king. The king was astonished and very pleased, but he did not express his feeling. He was secretly planning for another adventure. Thank you. Bye-bye.